Alyssa Michelle Stevens, born December 22, 1998, known professionally as Lato or Big Lato, formerly known as Mulatto, is an American rapper from Atlanta, Georgia. She first appeared on Jermaine Dupri's reality television series The Rap Game in 2016, where she was known as Miss Mulatto and won the show's first season, but rejected signing to Dupri's So So Deaf Recordings label of which was offered as a result. Lato rose to prominence after releasing her 2019 single Bitch from the South, which received double platinum certification by the Recording Industry Association of America, RIAA, and marked her first entry on the Billboard Hot 100. Upon signing with RCA Records, it was issued as the lead single for her debut studio album Queen of the South, 2020, which performed moderately on the Billboard 200 and spawned the platinum certified single Mewop, featuring Gucci Mane. In 2021, she was named as MTV's Global Push Artist of the Month. Following a name change to Lado, she reached wider mainstream recognition following the release of her 2021 single Big Energy. The song peaked at number 3 on the Billboard Hot 100, received triple platinum certification, and landed at number 7 on the year-end Hot 100 chart. Its live performance received a Grammy Award nomination. Big Energy served as the lead single for her second studio album 777, 2022, which trailed commercially at number 15 on the Billboard 200. Lato was named Variety's Breakthrough Artist of 2022 and received a Grammy Award nomination for Best New Artist the following year. Her guest appearance on Jungkook's 2023 single 7 became her first song to peak atop both the Billboard Hot 100 and Billboard Global 200 while her single, Put It On De Floor Again, featuring Cardi B, peaked at number 13 on the former chart that same year. In addition to her two Grammy Award nominations, Lato received nominations for Best New Hip Hop Artist at the 2020 BET Hip Hop Awards and Top Rap Female Artist at the 2022 Billboard Music Awards. She was a part of the XXL Freshman class in 2020 and won the BET Award for Best New Artist in 2022. Lato received nominations for Best New Artist, Video for Good, and Best Hip Hop at the 2022 MTV Video Music Awards. Big Energy won Song of the Year, and 777 was nominated for Hip Hop Album of the Year at the 2022 BET Hip Hop Awards. Early Life Alyssa Michelle Stevens was born in Columbus, Ohio, on December 22, 1998, to Misty Pitts and Shane Stevens. She attended Lovejoy High School in Clayton County, Georgia. She credits Clayton County as the place that gave her street credibility. Her mother is white and her biological father is African American. Stevens was bullied in school for being light skinned, which inspired her to later adopt the stage name Miss Mulatto when she began her rapping career. After the Mulatto racial classification, at the age of 10, Stevens decided to become a rapper and began writing her own rap songs. Prior to doing music, she participated in drag racing. Career 2016-2018, Career Beginnings and the Rap Game Lato In a 2018 interview in 2016, Stevens became a contestant on the Lifetime reality series The Rap Game, produced by Jermaine Dupri and Queen Latifah. The boot camp style series followed young aspiring rappers in a competition against one another over a span of eight weeks. Lato, under the stage name Miss Mulatto, at the time, was the overall winner of the competition. She was offered a recording contract from Dupree with So So Deaf Records, but ultimately turned down the deal claiming it was not enough money, opting to be an independent artist. Stephen's second mixtape, Lato Let Em Know, was released in April 2017. The tape featured artists like Molly Brazy, Lil Key, Crucial, and Silento. The single response diss is a diss song directed toward Young Lyric, a fellow competitor from the rap game. The ongoing feud between the two resulted in diss tracks from both parties with insults about drug use, homosexuality, and past experiences from the show, 2019-2020, Breakthrough and Queen of the South in January 2019, Lato released the song Bitch from the South. In May 2019, she was invited to perform at the Rolling Loud, an annual hip-hop festival, located in Miami, Florida. In June 2019, she released her second extended play, titled Big Lado, which was preceded by Bitch from the South. The single became her breakout hit, peaking at number 95 on the Billboard Hot 100 chart.
and was certified gold by the Recording Industry Association of America, RIAA, in the United States. The song later received a remix, featuring rapper Saweetie and Trina, which was later included on Mulatto's 30 P, Hit the Lato, which was released on December 12. In March 2020, it was officially announced that Lato had signed with RCA Records. On April 23, Lato released the promotional single, No Hook. On May 21, she released the second promotional single, He Say She Say. In July 2020, Lato recreated some of rapper Gucci Mane's album covers, starting with 2009's The State vs. Roderick Davis, to which Gucci reacted positively. Lato then revealed the release of her single Muop, featuring Gucci Mane, which was released on July 30. The song samples Gucci's 2007 single, Freaky Girl. Lato made a cameo appearance in American rapper Cardi B's music video for her single WAP, which was released on August 7, 2020. On the same day, Lato was featured on NLE Choppa's single Make M Say, taken from his debut studio album, Top Shotta. On August 11, Lato was included on XXL's 2020 freshman class. On August 12, Lato announced the release of her debut project through RCA, titled Queen of the South. It was released on August 21, 2020. The project was preceded by two singles, which were the remix to Bitch from the South and Mewop featuring Gucci Mane, as well as the promotional singles No Hook and He Say She Say. The album peaked at number 44 on the U.S. Billboard 200. On September 4, Lato was featured on the remix of the Chloe X Halley song, Do It, alongside Doja Cat and City Girls. The same day, Lato was also featured on Jeezy's single, Down. Music videos for the third and fourth singles from Queen of the South, On God and In and Out featuring City Girls, were released in September and October 2020, respectively. On September 29, it was announced that she had been nominated for Best New Hip Hop Artist at the 2020 BET Hip Hop Awards, where she was also a performer. On December 11, Mulatto released the extended version of Queen of the South, which included five new songs and spawned the single Sex Lies, featuring American rapper Lil Baby. 2021 Present, Name Change and 777 Lato performing in November 2021 and January 2021, it was announced that Lato would be changing her stage name from Mulatto following the controversy of the term being deemed as colorist. In February 2021, it was announced that Lato would be named MTV's Global Push Artist of the Month. In March 2021, she became the first female rapper from Atlanta to have a solo record be certified gold and platinum with Bitch from the South, 2019, and Muop, 2020. In May 2021, she confirmed in various interviews that she had officially settled on a new stage name, following scrutiny for the racially charged nature of her name. On May 18, it was reported that on streaming platforms, Mulatto's name had been changed to simply Lato, a change first reflected on her guest appearance on Tussie's album Thank You For Believing, where she was credited as Lato. She released a new single titled The Biggest, to go with the announcement of her new name. On September 24 of that same year, Lato released the lead single from her then-upcoming second studio album, Big Energy. The song became Lato's highest-charting song on the Billboard Hot 100 peaking at number 3. American singer Mariah Carey appeared on the official remix, which was released in March 2022. A follow-up single, Southside, was released on November 5, Lato in an interview with WHTA in 2023 on March 9, 2022, Lato announced that the song Wheelie would be released on March 11, and confirmed it would feature fellow Atlanta rapper 21 Savage. All three songs were included on Lato's second studio album, 777, which was released on March 25. On July 15, she released the song Pussy, duh. Lato was featured on Chloe Bailey's single For the Night, duh. In February 2023, Lato was nominated for Best New Artist at the Grammy Awards. She released the single Lottery on February 17. In July, Lato appeared as a featured artist on South Korean singer Jungkook's debut solo single Seven Dot. It debuted at number one on the Billboard Hot 100, becoming her first song to reach the top spot of that chart. She was included in Forbes 30 Under. 30 list for 2024 music. On October 12, 2023, Lato released Did Somebody Say, a rap opera collaboration with singer Christina Aguilera, 
In January 2024, Lato was featured on the remix version of Jennifer Lopez's song, Can't Get Enough, the first single out of Lopez's upcoming album This Is Me, Now. On February 5, 2024, Lato announced her single, Sunday Service, via social media. The cover artwork depicts a collage of prominent women rappers printed on a cyclorama back, the eyes of Lato, and all the featured rappers are concealed by a black box or horizontal black bar. Philanthropy in 2021, Lato founded the Win Some Give Some Foundation to empower at-risk young women by providing them resources and support to achieve a lifetime of success. Personal life in 2017, Lato opened her own store, Pit Stop Clothing, in Jonesboro, Georgia. In May 2019, Lato was arrested for theft when she was mistaken for another woman. She released a track, Fuck Rice Street, attesting to her innocence and anger toward the police. Discography Queen of the South, 2020, 777, 2022, Tours Headlining Big Lato Tour, 2019, 777 Tour, 2022, Supporting Lizzo, The Special Tour, 2022-2023.